بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه ومن تبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين ما بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. This is going to be a regular occurrence where I'll be sitting in the car or elsewhere and we're recording on my phone. It takes a lot of effort to set up the lights and then position the camera and then get it you know get the mic ready etc i do this all on my own um more important videos uh i would obviously endeavor to you know take the time out to do it but this particular video doesn't really warrant it now our brother abu musab watched the akari um hadaullah wa iyana uh may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide him and us and uh you know give him the best in this world and the hereafter he you know, has been going back and forth with uh, the brothers from Al Islam Productions, and part of that, you know, he's made some comments, uh, and I thought, you know, as his brother, you know, to address some matters which he vehemently opposes. But I just want to see if he's consistent right now. This is where it, it boils down to the consistency. So he critiqued Sheikh Yusuf Al Qardawi, rahmatullah alayhi, regarding his uh, support for the Arab Spring. Just the al al ثورة الربيع العربي that in and of itself أقسم بالله that in itself is one of the scariest things the number of people that died because of his enticement to the people and calling them him telling someone in, in, on, on video on TV whoever can kill Muammar al-Qaddafi let, let them kill him and save the Bilad and the Ibad from his evil after he had taken pictures with him and he was promoting him ربيع العربي he has reservations regarding that term but you know each to their own and what I want him to do is also condemn Rabi al Madhali, Hadahullah, may Allah guide him, uh, in the same manner that he condemned uh, Rabi, uh, sorry, Sheikh Yusuf al Qardawi. Look, at, at the end of the day, look, Uqsumu Billah, you cannot be a fanatical sectarian monster. And this is what we're finding amongst many Salafis, unfortunately. But that's, that's irrelevant now. Leave, leave that to one side because I, I'm, I'm, I know I've made some comments in the past and I've been aggressive and I've said things. I, I don't want to, you know, fall into the same uh, mistakes that I've done last time. But what we'll do now, okay, it's very, 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 very important for you now to understand that there's serious, serious inconsistencies. You condemned Yusuf al Qardawi in a harsh manner. But now let's see if you are consistent in terms of when... Rabi al Madhali, who's a Salafi, also called for Khuruj. He called for Khuruj against a legitimate ruler according to your standards. Okay, like, you know, you don't care if it's a secularist, you don't care if it's a Marxist, you don't care if it's a communist, you don't care if it's, you know, whatever it may be, you know, <laughs> I don't even need to go into the other examples. So let's listen to Sheikh Rabi al Madhali call for Khuruj against a leader that they would obviously hold as legitimate because he's just a ruler, right? We have standards where, you know, you got the legitimate Shari'i ruler, but obviously that's where the, um, the semantics is. But let's play the video. Don't try to change the topic. Mm -hmm. Don't okay. change the topic, Shamsi. You Madkhalis. Second thing Madkhalis. is, and this, I'm challenging the Madkhalis on this. Allahu Akbar, he's challenging the Madkhalis on this. Wait a second, Akhwar, we have to be careful because even though I'm not a Madkhali, I'm sure I'm intended. Because if you're Salafi, you become a Madkhali, even if you're not really on the same page as uh, Sheikh Rabi al Madkhali. Hafizahullah. I mean, I'm not, I've never followed the, uh, his opinions regarding Jarh and Ta'deel and those matters. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not a, a, a blind follower of, uh, of Sheikh Rabi. Ah. He's one of the scholars of the Ummah and he has his good and he has his uh, issues just like every other sheikh out there. I'm not one of those, uh, you know, burnt out pseudo Salafis, but according to them, khalas, ya madkhali, because that's a convenient term to use. Uh, obviously, uh, madkhali is, is just like a Dio Bendi in this regard. And Shamsi, and Farouk everyone. and Shamsi like both need to fix their recitation of the Quran. Like, just sort yourself out. Just stop laughing though. Okay. And come off this whole thing of our way or the highway. Sheikh Rabi Al Madkhali is not going to help you on the day of judgment, bro. Mashallah, mm. they're talking about Sheikh Rabi. They, they're, they're using Sufi because the, the Sufis are the ones, you know, will tell you that their Sheikh is going to help him on the, in the question in the grave. Now they're using the tactics uh, against us, right? So now they're going to say Sheikh Rabi is not going to help you. I don't think any Salafi on earth believes that Sheikh Rabi is going to help him on Yom Al Qiyamah. But, anyways, anyways, just let them enjoy the ride. Uh, the situation of Haftar. You know, the, he's, uh, he's got his, his, his militia, which are made up of box-headed madakhila, you know, are on the way to rebel against Sarraj. Uh, but I thought 
that it's not permissible to rebel against a ruler, no matter who he is. It could be a secularist, it could be a, you know, Marxist, it could be a communist, it could be a socialist, you know, you just can't rebel, you know, unless it's Shaw Kufrun Bawahan, according to you. So why is it that when it comes to Haftar, who's committed all sorts of crimes, and what we'll do, what we'll do, just for you, okay, just for you, we're going to play it uh, audio now, which Rabi' al-Madkhali, okay, quite clearly endorses Haftar, okay, and you'll listen to it now. You, you heard Rabil Madkhali state that it is incumbent on all the Salafiyin, all the Salafis, to fight under the banner and the flag of Haftar. Okay, clearly. War criminal. So you heard our brother Musa Wajdi Akari mention. The, uh, I'll keep looking at the screen where I really should be looking at the camera <laughs> So apologies for that But you heard our brother uh, Musa Wajdi Akari mention that uh, Sheikh Rabi has mistakes You know, Sheikh Rabi has mistakes and uh, You know, he has issues etc But you opposed Sheikh Yusuf Al-Qardawi for his support for the Arab Spring Now you've, you know, heard Sheikh Rabi Al-Madkhali call for khuruj Against an established leader Now anyone knows about the Libyan um, a civil war uh, Haftar was the defense minister of Sarraj and he took up arms and rebelled against his leader which he declared as his leader he was his defense minister so how can Sheikh Rabi Hadahullah call for a rebellion or call to arms and then request all the Salafis you know to go out and take up arms and fight their ruler where's uh, Kufr Bawahan where's Honoring the hadith of the Messenger sallallahu alaihi wasallam, where are you guys now? So, will you condemn Sheikh Rabi Al Madkhali? Let's be fair. Would you do that? I want to hear you now. Maybe you're unaware of it. That's possibly true. So, I'm not saying you were aware of it and then you, you know, ignore to come out and and criticize Sheikh Rabi. No problem. You weren't aware of it. But now we've released this information to you. We have transmitted this information to you that he called for khuruj against a legitimate ruler. Where are you? Will you condemn him now? That's the, the million dollar question. Will you condemn him? That's the end of the video. That's it. Simple question, you my dear brother. Uksum billah. You know, we have our back and forth. We have different uh, methodologies. No problem. Will you condemn him? And if you don't, then it shows that you are a sectarian, fanatical monster. You have one standard for one sheikh. And then you have another standard. But you do have that if a Salafi makes a mistake, you have like, you know, you'll, you'll be more soft and you'll be more lenient. And you'll say, look, you know, it's Salafi. So, you know, <laughs> you, you'll have all sorts of excuses ready for the Salafi. So let's leave you as that. So short video. Take care of yourselves.